All right, so we've got the Eldridge necktie knot. Nice close-up here for you so you can see the layers and the arched patterns we've got here. I'll step back so you can actually see my finished length. That's far enough away. Full length. Even for a long torso, I'm six foot two, and the traditional tie length was enough for me to achieve the Eldridge knot. So let me take it down for you so you can take a look, and then I'll demonstrate the the book instructions for how to tie the Eldridge and why most tall people think they can't achieve it. I'm layering each of these. All right, back to the original position. So, to get the length necessary on the tying end, what I have to do is then shorten this one, two, three, four, about the fifth button on my dress shirt. There's that many, that's that much more fabric required for these additional steps. So, we'll begin the same way, bringing the wide end of the tie even with the placket of the shirt. Fold it away from the body in half, wings down so you get a nice dimple. Take the tie, low spiral. I'm going to wrap once around this side, bring it to the other side, and then we're going to spiral around this side as well. So that's extra moves there. We're going to now wrap the face, trying to keep these as tight as possible here. All right, and then go this side once again, loop, and then through there, and we're going to come down the neck as well. Tracing over the same. There we have it. It's a much fatter, wider knot because of the additional layers that were put in place underneath the knot. And still approximately three inches remaining on the tie itself. It's going to go between the neck strap and the collar. Bringing this back down. So a very large imposing Eldridge. Problem being it's now too short for my torso. If I'm wearing a vest no one's going to be the wiser but if you want to wear it out and exposed to show off the tie this is not the way to do it. I'm going to look, link back to the other video take a look and how I can do it for a taller body. And to take it down, there are no cheats for removing it. You have to reverse each step to take it back off once again. There we are.